we're looking at color subtraction again, but this time we've got two decimal numbers. But first of all, I'm going to write my first one, 6.3. What's important now is that I, I make sure that this decimal point stays in the right place. So I'm going to put my decimal point in first, right under the decimal point that I first put in. And I've got 2.94. 2.94. Now that looks all great at the moment, apart from I've got this space here. So I need to put a placeholder in. I'm going to put a zero because there's nothing there, but it's important that I put that placeholder in. Now I can start with my subtraction. I have zero take away four. And I can't do that. If I have nothing, I can't take four away. So I'm going to use the borrowing skill again. Borrow from this three, change that to a two. And now I've got ten. So I can do 10 take away 4, 6. I've got 2 take away 9. Again, 2 is not big enough. So I'll move across to the next column. Borrow 1. The 6 becomes a 5. And now I've got 12 here. 12 take away 9 is 3. I'm going to make sure my decimal point moves down. And finally, I've got 5 take away 2 is 3. 